Hi, this is Robin Moses and I'm here with Guru. I've started this tutorial with a very dark blue and I ombre it with a light blue and then went across the end with a black. Now I'm going to make a snow globe. So I'm mixing brown and black together and I'm making a small C like this right in the center and pushing down and then going around like this. This will be the base. I'm going to paint in the bottom. Now this is almost the exact same color as the nail polish I used. So you could go actually and then just and just uh, paint the whole thing blue just to make sure and you don't get confused. So you just want a blue circle that matches your polish color. Now with a lighter blue I'm just going to add white to the blue that I have. With little tiny hatch marks or dots almost you want to go in and make a circle like this. Okay, then I'm going to put in the scene. So what I want to do is I want to make a little snow scene. So I'm going to make the little trees like this and um, just using dots, make the little snow trees. Then at the bottom, not quite to the base, I'm going to just dot along the bottom little tiny dots so that you can tell that it's full of little snows. A little snow like that. It's going to start to mix together and some of my paint's going to be a little bit blue. It's not going to be pure white and that's okay. If you want pure white, you go back in and then dot your tree in a little bit better. Then with um, the white, I'm just going to go on the very out, see how this is, I left myself a dark blue line around the edge, right on that edge. I'm going to take my paint and pull it across like that. And then um, on the other side, I'm going to take the same white and see where I gave myself a little tiny bit of extra room? Going around like that. Dotting in at the bottom. Dot, dot. Like that. Then da, 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 da. I am going to make a little dot on the top and kind of wish it around just to make it look more 3D and more like glass, like that. And then we're going to take that white and make it very thin. And then I get to decorate the base. So the base will be decorated across the end like this. Now this has a um, top coat of matte on the top of it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to completely um, matte top coat the, the whole design and I will meet you back. I think I'm going to add a little tiny little bottle of white right here too. Just the tiniest little dots. You don't want too much, but you want to make sure that your, your circle shows. Okay, so here it is in its finished form. You can finish it, you can finish it like that. This is with a matte top coat. Um, and you could stop right now and have it perfect. I am going to make it a little bit more 3D. So I'm taking some clear gel and I'm just gonna dot it right in the center of the snow globe like this. Then I'm gonna take a little tiny little stick and kind of mesh it around to the end edges so that it's nice and round. If you guys have a better way to do it, that's fine. But I don't want to get it, when I get it like that, I'm going to add a little tiny bit more. Go back in, and then you're going to have a little circle. I'm going to hang it upside down and cure it for about 30 seconds, and then I'll meet you back. All right, and here is the end result of the snow globe. And from the side, it's just barely raised. 
but it's 3D and it's all encapsulated and beautiful. And it is with my um, it's 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 on another design, but this is just the end result, the end uh, nail. And I wanted to have a tutorial just for the snow globe. So for the rest of this design, you can see this in the link below, and um, and do the whole design yourself. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So if you try these, please show me at Robin Moses Nail Art on Facebook or on Instagram. I'm on both places, and they're all linked below. Everybody have a wonderful Christmas. Christmas and I will see you back with more. Bye! Bye.